Hello, hello, this is Tokyo Blue, and you've come to Game Station Tokyo. Looks like we're going to be starting off the week. Uh, Thanksgiving holiday is over. Just want to welcome you back. Uh, we'll be doing episode 25 of The Evil Within. Uh, last episode, I had to go get a pair of glasses. Hopefully, I won't have to do anything so extreme this, this next episode. Uh, so, in the words of Jeffrey Chaucer, time and tide wait for no man. Better start searching for my partners. See, I want to turn the light. Oh, there's something glowing over there. What is it? Oh, it's a bar. Uh, it's a jar. Partially buried in the dirt. Good thing I did turn the light on. Um, over here. Can I go under the stairs? Like modern day stairs? I heard Leslie saying going to get you, get you, get you. Uh, last episode, I think he was talking to Kidman, and uh, they were downstairs. I guess that's where we are now. Now, I wonder if this uses, it must use the same amount of shells. There I have eight, but here I have ten. I'll keep to the double barrel, see how well that does. Oh wait, I can make some. Can't make any, I need three. Uh, I don't want to make a flashball. Can I make poison, fire, or poison? Can't make, oh, I need five, holy smokes. All right. We'll wait, uh, look at that, all right. This looks like some sort of sarcophagus. Uh, a lot of candles. I don't know why. Maybe they didn't have electricity back then. Oh, fantastic. Uh, I guess this is just an area where I'm going to be able to restock on things. Can I climb that? Can't climb it. Uh, yeah. Don't bring Sebastian to the party. He's going to break everything. Uh, nothing. Got nothing out of that. Uh, get Sebastian drunk and he just goes wild. Um, something shining over there. What are those rats? Should I shoot them? I wonder if I can scare them. Yeah. <laughs> you clod. <laughs> I'm gonna step on you. That's right. Here it comes. Oh yeah, out of the ballpark. <laughs> uh, you know, survival of the fittest, only the strongest and the fittest and in this case the smartest survive. <laughs> Definitely want a explosive bolt, please. Wait a minute, explosive fire. I need five parts and five parts for poison. Look at that, there's a little brain on the end of that uh, bolt. Poison bolt. 
Alright, we'll make one of these. Parts near. I got four parts. Alright. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um. Hmm. It's a painting of the pastor, I think, up there. Before I go up there, I'm going to look around the outside of the room first. I think that's probably the smarter thing to do. Uh, anything? Nothing. So I can walk around here with lights on. But they're giant sarcophaguses. I wonder if they're giant, you know, zombie guys in there. Coming for me again. Oh no, I wanted to grab that. See how big this sarcophagus is? Whoa! <laughs> I wasn't looking. Alright. It's been a while since I've done one of these. Um, gonna give it a go. I need parts. I want to make another pyro boat bolt or a poison bolt. Come on, face forward. Here we go. Bingo! Oh, two parts too. Thank you. Make some more explosive bolts. Uh, or should I save it? I'm wondering what the damage is on these things. Is it higher? Thank you. That one. Thank you. Okay. Definitely use the shells. Oh, rounds. Full. Yeah, I'm full. Okay. Come on, I gotta hit one big one on this one. Give me three things. One, two, any more? Only two. Some breathing. Turn your volume up. I hear something breathing. I heard something breathing. All right. Looks like a vampire. Uh, gotta go up. There's a bottle. Doing some stealth killing, maybe? Oh, yeah. Who is this guy? Probably the pastor. Uh, looks like he's snoring for eternity. Anything up here? Some parts. Two parts. Not enough to make anything yet over there. That's where I'm going. Wait, that's where I came from. Yeah, that's where I came from. I guess I'm going this way. Wait a minute. There's no walkway here. Did I miss something? I didn't get anything. Okay. So what did oh the stairs of course got to go up. I think I got everything in this didn't I? All right, here we go. Yeah, growling. And it's dark. Well, I should get that bottle. It's a wall over there. I can't tell what's over there. Crowded hallway of zombies. Okay, there's... I'm not going that way. I'm going to the right. 
Hmm. A maze. I'm gonna be the maze runner. He's facing me. I'm gonna have to get that bottle. I'm gonna get that bottle. Now, it looks like his back is toward me. Kinda. No, he's face. Oh, yeah, his back was toward me. Mm. Or is he walking toward the wall? His back is toward me now. Let's see if he stays that way. Let's see who's in this room. Oop. Coming toward me. Like Batman, I can hide in the shadows. Alright. Yikes! That's all. Give me my rifle. My shotgun. Oh no! Run, run, run! Where's that thing? Whoop. I botched this one up. So something glowing. Come over here. Oh. Oh, they found me! Oh no! Run! Run! I hate to wait an ex waste an explosive bolt on these guys. Thank you. What a waste. Okay. <laughs> okay. What a game. Give me the shells. Give me the shells. I want to reload it. There we go. Uh, what do we got here? Stick with a harpoon for now. Um, and let's see. Full there. Okay. I'm wondering, uh, I want to go back to get those shells on the table. I'll just go to creating all this excitement. This should be clear now. Anything else? Ooh, big brain juice. Big one. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's right there in front of you, Sebastian. Come on. <laughs> Turn on the light. Is that better? Oh. Thank you. I get out. Can't use that. I'm full. All right. <clears throat> I don't hear any more howling. I could have spoken too soon. Let's see. There's a door over there. That's where the light is. 
another light. Tempting shells over there too. I don't hear any growling though. Mm. This is gonna come out through those doors. Yikes. Threshold. What is that? What was that? Did I miss something? I think I did. Turning around so much I just missed something. It's a dead end. Yeah. So I gotta go back to that door. Matches? Shells. Shells please? Yes. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Uh, right now on the East Coast, I'll give you a weather report. It's 29 degrees outside. Pretty cold. Wonder how it is where you guys are. Uh, let's see. I could use a syringe, huh? A little caffeine. Yeah. Thank you. Any med kits? No med kits. We'll put you down there for now. Hoping to run into Jill soon. Alright, when I gotta touch the door or something, I gotta inspect it. Like Inspector Clouseau. Well, what am I doing? Looks loose. Yeah, let's push it. Old lithograph. This lithograph was pried from a stone door. Yeah, I just saw myself do it. Where it seems to have been used as a key. So I gotta. Oops. Look at that. No one's been in here for a thousand years, and there, this lantern's been glowing. Oh, another safe. Wonder if I'm gonna go on some sort of hallucinogenic ride. Um, Alright, let's go in. Got my light on too. Oh, I don't. Oh, more parts. Okay. Is that a bed? There's a bed here. Can I stomp on that? Walk back here? No. Can I go over there? No. Weird. Look how that's look how that's shaped. It's like that guy in the hallway when Jill walked down it. Uh, it's like some guy's head. It's a helmet. It's a safe helmet. Designed to keep your head safe. I wonder if it's bulletproof. Serious brain juice going on here. I'm wondering when I'm gonna get to meet Jill. Read the notes in a second. Mmm, yum. Okay. Uh, this is gonna be evil dungeon note number one. Catacomb note. I was close. Uh, help! The metallic pounding. He's coming. I run, but he follows. Help, God. Help, 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 help. Must be a severe echo in this catacomb. Yeah, Mr. Big Boss is coming, and I've used both of my explosive bolts. <clears throat> Ooh. Should I go with the uh, incendiary? I like it. I just don't know how much damage it inflicts. And I've been... I'll go with the explosive bolt because I've been upgrading my explosive bolts to be more deadlier. So we'll go with that. Alright. I'll compare the explosive bolt and the incendiary bolt later. I see Jill. Um, no 
else over here? Uh, so today's uh, f Friday. It's after Thanksgiving. Whoops! Checkpoint! Checkpoint! Thank you. Um, had my fill of turkey yesterday. Had my fill of turkey today for lunch. Had my fill of turkey today for dinner. And I feel I'm gonna have some more turkey tomorrow. Uh, it looks like a big battle is coming up. Oh, it's a lock. Now, something else I've been reading, I think I maybe have told you already, is those locks you're supposed to be able to shoot or break. Hey, there's someone standing over there. You see him? Hmm. I have no incentive to want to break that lock now. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, good. He got crushed. I don't have to worry about him now. Oh, boy. Is right. Let me recover some parts before I go in. Get my butt wiped. This guy's gonna wipe me across the floor. Give it a trot. <gasps> Nothing. They didn't give me anything. Not, not even incentive to go in that room. Oh. That's where the lithograph goes. You see? There's three of them. That means I gotta find three keys. Let them out and then fight them? Oh, boy. You gonna break it? Yeah. Darn it. There were so many of those locks back there I could have broken. Oh, boy. There's Jill over there. A weird door. We just saw a guy with the hammer or something. The axe. Go in there. Alright. Still a little exploring. Looks like I'm going to be doing a lot of running around in circles in this room. Uh, I'll take a walk down here. Why not? Boo. Boo. Didn't open it. So what we got? Some sort of mechanism. Is there a lever around I got to pull? Let's go see Jill. And we got no keys whatsoever. Uh, another diary entry. No floor, nothing. Forest clean. No roaches, okay. Let's read, give this a read. Lily's birthday announcement. Okay, so she's come to term. Myra's come to term. We welcome with love Lily Lynn Castellanos, born July 18th, 2006. At 9.56 a.m., she's 7 pounds, 3 ounces, 14 inches. Proud parents, Sebastian and Myra Castellanos. Yeah. So they did get married. They had a child. There was some accident, and Sebastian turned to drinking. Uh, all right. I'll be right back, unless there's something in there for you guys to read. Catacombs found beneath Parish. Okay, we should read that. I see. How you doing, Jill? It's been a while, I know. Catacombs found. Catacombs found beneath parish. Pastor says, nothing to lose sleep over. Who took care of this place? Workmen repairing collapsed floor discovered man-made passages beneath Cedar Hill Church. Sorry. Claim they saw mummies. Parish denies access to historians, claiming sacrilege. Hmm. So we have a bunch of catacombs. Someone doing an experiment on the mentally ill. What's going on? I'm getting a good mixture of stories here. Let's see who's missing. Chris Taylor. Missing Chris Taylor. Construction foreman. 
disappeared while overseeing repairs of a fallen church floor. Repairs were nearly completed, so it's, it is unlikely he fell. Please, information needed, call one 525 6969 Alright. Check out... I'm going to go check out the juice bar. I'll catch you guys in a little bit. And that brings us to the end of another episode. That was episode 25. Please come back and join me for episode 26 of The Evil Within. Uh, just to bring you guys up to speed, while you were gone, I did do some upgrades to the weapons. Uh, I believe I had 8,400 bottles of brain juice, so I, I went in and I upgraded the harpoon, uh, the agony the harpoon bolt. Uh, I did it twice uh, so that the damage is, uh, is greater. I upgraded the pistol and I went ahead and I increased the critical hits so that uh, I have a greater chance of performing a headshot. So until next time, I'm your host Tokyo Blue, and you've come to Game Station Tokyo.